Hello everyone, my name is John. Today, I will tell you how to set up an integration to transfer new customers from Key CRM to Salesforce CRM. This is necessary in order to automatically transfer new customers from Key CRM to other systems. For example, in Salesforce CRM, you can create new leads and conveniently interact with them in the future. Now let's move on to the setup. First, you need to create a new connection. Next, you need to select the key CRM data source system. Now you need to choose an action. In this case, select Get Customers, New. At this stage, you need to connect your key CRM account to the Apex Drive service. In this window, you must specify the API key. To get it go to your personal account key CRM. Next, go to Settings. General. If you haven't created an API key yet, click Create API Key. Copy it and paste it into the appropriate field in the Apex Drive system. When the required field is filled, click Continue. When the connected account is displayed in the list of active accounts, select it and click Continue. No additional settings are provided for the key CRM system, so just click Continue. At this stage, you can set up a data filter, in this case there is no need for this, so we also click Continue. Now you see the data for one of your key CRM customers, if everything suits you, click Continue. This completes the key CRM data source setup. Now you need to go to the data destination settings. We select the system, Salesforce CRM. Next, you need to select an action. Create lead. At this point, you need to connect your Salesforce CRM account to the Apex Drive system. In this window, specify the login and password of the Salesforce CRM personal account. When the connected login is displayed in the list of active accounts, select it and click Continue. At this point, you see the Salesforce CRM fields for generating new leads. You can assign variables from Key CRM to these fields. In order to do this, click in the field and select a variable from the drop-down list. But first, choose the status. Note that you can use not only variables, but also write values manually. When all the required fields are filled, click Continue. At this point, you see an example of the data that will be sent to Salesforce CRM as new leads for every new customer from Key CRM. If something does not suit you, click Edit and you will go back one step. In order to check the correctness of the settings, click Send Test Data to Salesforce CRM. After successful submission, go to Salesforce CRM and check the result. If everything suits you, return to the Apex Drive system and continue setting up. This completes setting up Salesforce CRM as a data destination. Now you need to enable auto-update and select the update interval, for example once every 5 minutes. That's all, I wish you successful integration settings and good luck.